A massive split in Congress over imminent coronation of Rahul Gandhi as party president. All guards like Congress uh, leader Amrinder Singh have put their foot down over elevation of Rahul Gandhi. Amrinder Singh spoke exclusively to executive editor Javed Ansari and said if Rahul Gandhi takes over and sidelines Congress's old timers, then he will leave the party. Amrinder added that he has a great affection for Rahul, but the Congress leader must learn the ropes, gain an experience, travel and spend time with Congress workers before taking over. The captain asked both Rahul and Priyanka Gandhi must work together to revive the party. I'm very fond of Rahul. I've known him since he was a child, uh, at the age of five or maybe even less. And uh, I've seen him grow. But you know, in, in, in every form, in every walk of life, you have, everyone has to buy this time. You've got to learn your trade, you've got to go up. Whether I was a second lieutenant when I was there, I couldn't, uh, you know, uh, uh, profess to become a general overnight. You've got to learn your business and go up. So what you're now, essentially saying is he's not ready. Uh, no, what I'm trying to say is that he's, he means well. If I sit with him for uh, half an hour, he will talk about various things. He will be very interactive and all. But being interactive is one thing. But knowing our country, knowing the problems, knowing the people, having a one-to-one -one with everyone, in every, like Mrs. Gandhi did in 77. After we lost the elections, I was one of those who lost those elections with her. And she took a train and she went around the whole country. And she would stop at 3 o'clock in the morning and there were six people on the platform. She'd get out and address them. Now that is the thing that you require. I know times have changed, televisions have come in, but that, that, that's very impersonal. You need a personal interaction with people. And I think in due course, given time, yes. But at the moment, no. I think Mrs. Gandhi uh, should be there. I don't know. I think if, if he takes over in the way that uh, we hope he takes over, if he talk, takes over, that means, and uh, uh, in that way, I think he should consider everybody, whether old or young or middle-aged, to be part of a team. And I hope he does that. But if he goes by this business of cutting uh, and le leaving one section out and trying to build the other section, it's not going to work. There's some people who say that some of the old guard could even you know, part ways with the party. Do you yes, think? I've heard that. I've heard that from various... Uh, uh, not only Punjab, I've heard this from everywhere. Everyone I bump into, even in Delhi here, regardless of which state he belongs to, uh, us are talking in these terms. So, perhaps there could be a split in the Congress party if... I hope not. I hope not. Because for the sake of the country, I hope not. And for the sake of our party, I hope not. But, uh, you know, if, if when, you are, when you are at that level, you can't, you can't uh, single out people by saying this, this, this should be there or that should be there. You have to take everyone in your stride. And I hope he will uh, understand that if he is to take over, which uh, I still feel that Mrs. Gandhi should continue for some time till he really fits into the, into the, um, fits the bill. I shouldn't say fits the bill, but certainly fits into the system and on the way that I think he should fit, fit into the system. Well, let me now go across uh, to Executive Editor Javed Ansari, who is joining us uh, from the newsroom. Uh, he got us this exclusive interview with uh, Captain Amrinder Singh. Uh, Javed, what's the sense that you get, uh, get, that you get after this uh, interview? There are a lot of people, those who have openly started talking against Rahul Gandhi and the timing of this leave uh, that he has taken, uh, that has extended for uh, many weeks now. Yes, Ankit, the sense, that the unmistakable sense that I get is that there is more, that there are more than two opinions within the party with regards to Mr. Rahul Gandhi's elevation as the Congress president. There are the likes of Digvijay Singh and Kamal Nath who believe that it should happen as early as of yesterday. But there are others who believe that he must bide his time, he needs more time, needs more experience, needs to, to get, get a grip get a grip before he takes over the time mm. is not ripe and and captain amrinder singh in the course of that uh, interview to me clearly indicated that if rahul gandhi uh, as is being said if rahul gandhi takes over and then begins sidelining the old guards then they will have to consider other options including leaving the party that is a real war that is going on within the Congress party despite the drubbing that they got in Lok Sabha. It seems that uh, it is completely divided camp. The old guard versus the new. 
also a very interesting javed uh, amrinder singh is seen somebody who's very close to sonia gandhi it was on mrs gandhi's insistence that he fought the election from amritsar he coming out and speaking against rahul gandhi he coming out and saying that uh, if uh, the old guard is sidelined he will resign how do you see that uh, as far as the congress top leadership is concerned look this is something that will make the congress leadership ponder this will make mr rahul gandhi think about think twice and this will make the congress leadership think twice because they shouldn't be they, they shouldn't be doing something in a hurry which could which could rebound recoil on the party after all they they are uh, a party is made of it's a voluntary organization and made of of all kinds of people and therefore uh, a leader uh, a good leader is one that takes everybody along it's a voluntary organization you can't thrust uh, choices down to people throat it's not that people that amrinder singh is particularly against rahul gandhi what he is uh, uh, not in favor of uh, what the likes of him are not in favor of is the fact that he should take over immediately and this uh, and this talk of totally sidelining some of the old guards and then beginning anew that is what is hurting them and that's what they objecting to